Start again. Three, two, one, go. So, alright, this is the Ben Smith 1cc. I will get it. I said this is serious time. Do you not understand the concept of serious time, sir? You're not. Oh my god. Why am I sucking so hard this morning? I mean, wow. Like, I know Ben Smith isn't exactly as godly as he was before. But seriously? I've been getting buffed by this dude, like, super hard this morning, and it's not funny. It's really not. This is a first fight, like, really? I'm gonna suck this bad? First fight in the game? Yeah, in a little camera glitch, you can do that if uh, both people are on the ground, and both people are on the ground at very extreme, extreme opposites. The game doesn't know what to do. It's kind of funny, but at the same time, you don't really want that to happen most of the time. So yeah, like Joe, 2D plane fight, more of a traditional fighting game status, except, you know, if this was a traditional fighting game, it wouldn't have, I wouldn't be playing this. So yeah, you can, on 2D planes you can actually do that, you can actually cross them because they rebound off the wall. You'd think that would be a mix-up, but no, it's not, because I'm, first I'm playing the computer, and second, because, well, blocks are random anyway, so... Well, they're random in a sense. I mean, I don't know exactly what causes them, and I don't think anybody actually ever figured that out. I know movement back in some situations will cause the block animation to come out, but that's not guaranteed like this. When you see when you see him uh, ring, sucking his that... That's the symbol, like, okay, you're in block stance, kind of. So you can totally block by holding back, but it's not relating at all to your opponent's attacks. So, it's kind of a crapshoot. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna play it safe and I... Oh, or the bear's gonna play it safe and it actually, uh... Back up from getting kicked in the dick. Like, Bear, show me the balls. Where are your balls, Bear? Like, I need to find them to kick you in the dick. Here we go. Kick Bear in dick is complete. So obviously we're going to be powering up. Oh yeah, that's one mechanic I haven't explained yet. Uh, we're gonna... When we power up, uh, it boosts any attack that's essentially a punch or affected by the punch button, except on Ron Max, which there's another attack that gets powered up. It's actually pretty funny, and if I can get to that, once I get to that, I'll show, I'll show you guys. Oh yeah, apparently there's also some attacks that have auto guard, <laughs> as you may have seen, and I don't know what causes that either, because it's not an error to the attack, because I've interrupted that attack before. Yeah, I'm trying to do this E-plane abuse and it's not going well. I mean, as you can see, I blocked, so... Clutch block! Really? Wow, that that was clutch. Uh, I'm gonna... I wanna take... I want. I really want to take... Um, credit for this? But it really wasn't. I was just backing up out of... Uh, <laughs> I was backing up because I didn't want to get kicked in the face. I uh, didn't set up the Z plane properly. Alright, let's see if it works. Yep, got it. Just 
Nope, don't got it. Got it. Nope, don't got it. Fortunately, you can do that too. That's another way of manipulating the AI that in such a way that, well, they kill themselves. Because they're going to come to you and they're going to try and do an attack that either tries and reach you, but f since you're not moving, you can actually retaliate. So that's not so bad. Alright, time for the footsie battle. But obviously, he can play footsies with his head, so. Oh my god, really? Like what he just did right now? If I could do that as Ron Max, I would have, uh, I would have started with that one CC immediately because it's so free. So the opponent can literally do nothing about this except if they block, and for some reason, well, the block is random, so. If I can get into the corner, I'll be in a good position. Because, yeah, what you want to avoid is that he wakes up with headbutt. He wakes up with headbutt, well, that's almost a guaranteed knockdown. Here we go. Yeah, music can have serious time, so we're gonna be in serious time. No balls. Okay, that was lucky, but I'll take it. Like, I, I don't even deserve that, but, you know, fuck it. Because usually, when they'll do throws, for some reason there's a glitch in the game that causes the throw to launch you super high in the air and they can juggle you after. Which is cool, and it, it's kind of cool, but at the same time, if I could repro that, I'd probably try and do it every single time. It's a free hit. So let's say you have a real powerful attack. Yeah, I'm gonna kick the base of the tiger in the dick. So yeah, as you can see, I can do I can do knee strats or I can do safe strats, and even the safe strats are still pretty fast. So if I want my second power up, because well, Tony One has been a dick. So yeah, sub 10 is possible. I'll be happy if I get it. But I don't think I will. <laughs> but yeah, as you can see, he's almost... He's hit me maybe five times and that's half my life. I've hit him a lot more than that and that's not even half his life. Oh god. Kinda hope he A throw? Oh no. Well rip the sub to the sub ten. <laughs> rip sub ten, but whatever. As I said, this is a speedrun, it's just an added bonus by getting it. So even the final boss is not immune to this, by the way, as you can see. But the problem is that, well, since it's a uh, late, you can actually get out of it. But if you can loop him, it's pretty good. Okay, so that's the first round. Yeah, that would have been a that would have been a sub ten. I don't know. 
I didn't choke the first round, I would have been subbed down. Oh god. there's a gap in the actual music and we got it finally but there's a gap in the music it doesn't loop proper <laughs> i just noticed that and hey you again a victory again so that's on the third attempt actually i'm pretty glad about that anyway enjoy the victory screen while i save these splits and make new ones <laughs>